Well, in today's video, I got a box to open from eBay. Let's see how it came. What's up guys, BJ Kicks here. I buy comics, I read them, and I review them. All for your viewing pleasure. If you're new here, welcome. If not, welcome back. Uh, I do comic book videos on this channel. So if you like comics, consider subscribing. Now, in this video, it's gonna be a quick one. I've got an unboxing um, of an Omnibus from eBay. At least I think this is the Omnibus that I ordered on eBay. Um, I can't lie, I'm kind of nervous. This box is small. As you can see, the box has been dinged up a couple of times. Uh, so we're gonna see, but this is an out of print book that I was actually really excited to grab. Uh, hopefully it's not a disappointment. But before I open this box, I do have to let you know that I am going to be live on Whatnot this coming up Monday, March 28th at 7 p.m. Eastern. I'm calling it Milestone Monday. This is gonna be my first Whatnot sale. And I'm going to be uh, selling a lot of the duplicates from my Milestone Media collection. So uh, I got some static, I got some hardware, some Blood Syndicate, um, I got some stuff from the Worlds Collide crossover. Um, basically every series I've got some duplicates of, including a full set of the Death Wish miniseries. Uh, so you definitely gonna wanna be on the lookout for that. Uh, if you're not familiar, Whatnot is like a new, uh, it's like a mixture between like eBay, and like a Facebook live sale. So I'm gonna be live on Sunday uh, selling my milestone uh, duplicates from my collection. Um, and if you have not signed up for a Whatnot account, you can use the referral link in the description below and they'll actually give you a $10 spending credit that you could then use on the sale on Monday night. So hope to see you there uh, and thanks for checking me out. Now, Let's get into this box, because like I said, what should be inside is an out of print omnibus that is moving around quite a bit in this box. Um, but I mean, it's an out of print book and I got it. When I saw the price, I was like, huh, that's interesting. Why is it so low? So I was like, well, let me go ahead and try to snatch this up before they change their mind. So let's get in here. Ooh, this is not promising so we got a a book but you can see it's a pretty thin bubble wrap in here and that was all that was in the box so well may have been cheap for a reason so let's get into it So yeah, definitely not the best packaging, but it may be okay. It may be all right. Okay. All right. So definitely dinged up a bit, but overall, Still pretty decent condition. This is Captain America, the Return of the Winter Soldier Omnibus. This collects Captain America and Bucky, 620 through 628. Fear Itself, Bulk of the Book of the Skull, number one. Fear Itself, number 7.1. Captain America, Winter Soldier, one through 14. And Captain America, the 2011 series, issues 11 through 19. This is the end of the Ed Brubaker run on Captain America. Uh, so yeah, this is after the Fear Itself event. Very cool. Um, it's the end of an era for Cap and Bucky in the volume that takes you all the way from their glorious wartime past, past to the deadly threats that place their future in the balance. First of all, look at the artwork on the back of here. That's pretty awesome. Now, this is an out of print Marvel Omnibus that I have regularly seen selling for upwards of $150. But for whatever reason, there was a seller on eBay selling this for $64.95. And I was like, well, if they can wait till I get my paycheck, I'll do it. And I did it because it was still in stock. I think there were like eight more in stock when I ordered this. Uh, so I don't know if it's still available now. 
but the original cover price on it was nine or ninety nine ninety nine. So to pay less than retail for an out of print book. Now here's the here's the thing, right? Chances are, the way my luck goes with Marvel, this book is going to be reprinted sometime in twenty twenty three. Um, I mean, they already reprinted volume one, two, and three, um, but there was nothing solicited for volume four, which is the trial of Captain America. And the, or is it the trial? I think it's the trial of Captain America. And then the return of the winter soldier. Nothing, um, nothing, uh, has been solicited for those two. Uh, but if I know Marvel, they're always going to reprint stuff. They're pretty good about reprinting stuff. So the only way I was going to buy this book was if I could get it for retail or less. So I won't feel like I got burned, even if they do reprint this. Um, so that's exciting but watch them reprint it. So the last one that I need is The Trial of Captain America. And I'm just crossing my fingers for a reprint. It made the top 20 reprint or most wanted Marvel Omnibus reprints on the Uncanny Omar's list. So I'm, I'm hoping that because it made that list, uh, we'll get it sometime next year. Maybe even as a surprise this year, that'd be cool. Uh, but who knows? So, that's the unboxing. I won't, you know, belabor this. There's no need to stretch it out, but I'm excited about this. Uh, I've only read like midway through volume one of Ed Brubaker, but it's like so awesome that I was like, I need the whole run. I want to read it all. I want to know how it ends. And so I got a lot of Captain America. This is likely the only Captain America I'm ever going to pick up. I might pick up the Coates run since, uh, it's not, it's like, I think it's like 30 some issues. I might pick that up eventually, but I don't see myself buying a whole ton of Captain America Omnibus. Uh, but that's what I got for now. So this is the Return of the Winter Soldier. Hope you saw something you liked in this video. Don't forget about the Milestone Monday Whatnot sale going down this Monday at 7 p.m. And uh, I'll see you in another video very soon. Uh, until then, just make sure you buy what you like and read what you buy and be nice to others because kindness makes the world go round. Peace.